text modifiers are applied to the source text parameters of a text generator in plain text mode. We have modifiers such as substrings or remove strings, but we also see other modifiers in the list that seems to be intended only for working with numbers. So, what's their purpose? These modifiers appear because you can work with text that contains only numbers. In this case, Autograph can convert textual elements into numbers on the fly. For example, by entering a number with a decimal point and adding the wrong modifier, we can see that the decimal part of the number is removed. We can also add a math modifier that will allow us to add a certain value to the number represented by the text. There's no need to perform an explicit conversion from text to number or number to text. Autograph takes care of this conversion automatically. The same goes for modifiers applied to Boolean operations. The negate modifier, whose aim is to invert a true state into a false state, will return false for any value other than zero. On the other hand, if we enter a value of zero, which is equivalent to false, then the negate modifier will return the true state. With a value of one, which equal true, we'll get back the false state. A large number of numeric modifiers can therefore act on text element. We can extract the square root of a number, convert degrees into radians, apply a minimum or maximum value, or add a clamp modifier so that your number doesn't exceed a certain value. We can even use an animator. If we switch it to target value mode, the numerical value generated by this modifier will be directly re-injected as text. Here, we see that over a period of one second, the modifier will produce a new value for each frame. The numbers scroll until they finally reach zero. By setting the end value to 25, we see that the last value display will be 25. Keep in mind that as long as your string consists of numbers only, you can apply numeric modifiers to it. However, that if even one of these characters is not a number or a dot, Autograph will not be able to perform this implicit conversion from text to number. But if you respect this limitation, the possibilities are endless.